the new Toshiba Thrive full HDMI out. Hi YouTube, just wanted to give you a quick um, demonstration on the full HDMI feature that the Toshiba Thrive does have to offer. Um, just want to show you a quick few things here. I do have the HDMI cable, um, it's just running into my receiver. I do have the full uh, full Dolby Digital surround sound. Uh, just like to show you how quick and easy this does work. So um, I just plug it in, simple, power it on. Uh, it comes right up, as you can see. This full honeycomb 3.1 it offers. I do want to just say this that I absolutely love this tablet. I've done a lot of research on which one to get. Um, obviously, it's not a light penny you, you're going to be spending, so you want to make sure you're you're getting the the best tablet out there on the market that has. Um, but yeah, so here's a quick, I just want to give you a quick demonstration on the gameplay. Um, this is Cube Street, one of my favorite games. I love it. Um, and how it works. It works perfect here on, on here. There's no lag. Uh, the picture quality is excellent. Um, which is really good. So anyway, there's that demonstration for the gaming. I only have a couple minutes to do this and I really don't want to make it too long. Um, so let's do let's do a video. I don't have any video on the internal storage, but I can do like a v Vito. Um, I do have Vito right here. Um, so here, we'll bring that up. Let's see. We'll just we'll just play something real quick. Uh, let's see. Planet of the Apes. Uh, let's see how that's going. So there you go. Uh, this does have full HDMI or full HD. I'm not sure if it's 1080p or 720p. I'm sure you know that, but I just can't recall. Regardless, I know that it's HD, so that's good. Obviously, this is a boot. Um, but yeah, uh, everything works. The Bluetooth works. The SD card works. Uh, the file manager that they have that they provide to you is really good and really nice. And that's another thing that I really took into account when I purchased this. Um, I did see that the file manager was a lot nicer than like the Galaxy and whatnot. Not that you can't download a uh, file manager and uh, you know all that. And and the and the whole root thing, you are able to install unknown uh, market apps, which is really nice. It's right in the settings. Um, they have allowed that for me. That's a good thing. I'm really not trying to root this device as of yet. Um, if I can stay away from that, that's good. And with that unknown market app feature, it allows me to do that for right now. Netflix does not work, but I'm sure it will be in the market here shortly. Um, this here is a full HDMI can view video uh, from YouTube. You can view advanced. You can clear image clash and cache and view the version. But that's basically it. You can turn on and off location really switches nice. by default, which are usually pretty accurate with uh, phones with a GPS in them. Mm -hmm. And that's basically it. So you can check really out nice. this application. It does uh, also, one other thing I just wanted to show you real quick um, that it does offer, which I really like also, is called um, the, the, the server. Uh, let's see, where's it at here? Ah, if I, can, uh, if I can't even see it now, where's it at? Uh, it's not underneath. Oh, no, you know what? It's in the media. It's the media manager it's got. It's got it in the media, media player. Is that it? Yep, there it is, media player. Okay. So you got this, like, little home thing here, and then server list. I don't know if I have anything running on my or on my network right now. My home network. Oh, okay. Well, there we go. This is my um, my own my I Omega screenplay. Um, I don't know. So this is my video. Well, just a little portion here. Um, I don't I don't know. Let's see what. what, 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 what uh, let's see. I don't know what's this. I'm not even sure what this is. I don't even know if this is a file, actually. Um, now, keep in mind, this is obviously running running off of my network, so... Okay, there you go. This is off my home network. Um, you can't beat it. And that's non-rooted or anything. Um, absolutely love the Tachika Fly. I highly recommend it. I did the YouTube, I did that. Um, I also have Google Voice installed. I'm able to get all my text messages. Everything, I love the notifications with the Honeycomb 3.1. It is absolutely awesome. I can make phone calls as well with Groove IP. The, the call quality isn't the best, but it works. It does its job. Um, if you want to leave a comment or suggestions or anything, I mean, you're welcome to leave comments. 
Um, but I hope this video helped you out. I was kind of hoping. One other thing real quick. Um, I, I just bought this also because of the removable battery. I felt that was a necessity. Um, I don't want to be carrying around a dead weight per se. Um, if you buy a $700 tablet, the battery goes out within a year. Your warranty is not covering that. Then basically you just have a dead weight. That's my opinion. Now, I don't know what yours is, but I like the fact that you can remove the battery. You can replace the battery and also the, the back plate is um, you can get different colors and whatnot, which is really cool. The weight on this thing is not that bad, really. You can't even notice anything. I like it. It feels more durable, more sturdy. The back feels good and it just feels like a good quality uh, piece of material here. So I do highly recommend it. Um, don't know if I did the demonstration on the video or on the camera. Real quick, just want to show you that. This is the front. This is the front camera. Um, we'll do the, or no, excuse me, that was the back. And this is the front. There you go. It's okay. It's not bad. It's, it it actually works really well. It's five five megapixels. It's a lot better than the iPad. Not that I'm a complete iPad hater. I just don't like simplicity. I like to be able to control what I got. That's my video. I hope you liked it. Leave comments, concerns if you like.